What's going on, everyone? My name is Benny No, and this is the Benny No Road to the Show. We're back at it, and we're jumping right into a dynamic challenge, baby. Let's go with this goal to advance the runner. All right, my first Diamond Dynasty video, or it's actually Road to the Show, MLB The Show video. I'm going to take a pitch here since I got back from the World Series, and in this episode, I'm going to show you my epic reaction to the Dodgers winning the 2020 World Series. That just sounds so good to say. By the way, you guys, right here, got my epic World Series champions, Dodgers hat. It's the one hat that got pooped on. Super excited, Benny No, right off the bat. Is that gonna be gone? No. High fly ball to left field, took one and ripped it, but came up short. So we usually play three games in these videos, and at the end of this first game, I'm gonna show you my epic reaction to the Dodgers winning the World Series. So if you guys didn't know, by the way, daily videos every day, 10 a.m. Eastern, 7 a.m. Pacific. If you guys didn't know, my good friend and I, Bobby Crosby, along with our good friend T-Mobile, went to the World Series. We went to Texas for Game 6 of the World Series. We actually had tickets for Game 6 and 7. There's a rip. Darn it. But obviously the Dodgers won in 6, so we didn't have to go to a Game 7, man. Super epic. We were at the game. I'm going to tell you guys exactly how I felt um, leading up to the epic moment where we won. Obviously, if you guys saw the game, the pivot point was when... For some reason, the manager of the race took out Blake Snell. I don't know what to say. I mean, you guys have heard all the arguments about it. Everyone has their opinion about it. All I know is when that happened, Bobby and I looked at each other and we just knew the game was over. We knew we were going to come back and win. It was just something intuition inside where we just knew it was over. Benny No rips that one to left, baby. Come on. Did we get under that? Booga off the metal supply building, 420 feet off world two. Tried to beat it. Booga with the home run, man. Awesome. We're going to take a look at that replay as I explain more about the World Series, you guys. Wow. <clears throat> what a, what an epic. I mean, obviously, when they took Snell out, everything happened. Uh, what, what Austin Barnes gets on. Mookie Betts with the double brings him home. No, no, no. Mookie Betts with the double. They get on second and third. Pass ball, wild pitch, I don't remember, brings Austin Barnes home. Or, geez, that's how amazing it was. I can't even remember. <clears throat> I just remember the tying run was a oh, pass ball, wild pitch, runner comes in to score, and then the next hit, whoever hit it, I can't remember, brings in the second run. The Dodgers don't give up a run for the rest of the game. Mookie Betts hits the epic home run in the eighth, and that was it. And then by then, by the seventh, I think Julio Urias came in. And that was the end of it. We knew it was over, and it was celebration time, baby. As soon as they got that third out, that strikeout looking right down the plate. Oh, okay, guys. So just to let you know, <clears throat> I did not intend on, on filming any of this. I didn't bring a camera with me, nothing. So all I had was my phone, and was actually an Instagram live post. So right here, oh, we got one more at bat before I show you. It was an Instagram live post. It wasn't even a regular camera. So <clears throat> the footage is like the crappy. You're going to see the black bars and the tiny footage on the side. My apologies. Like I said, at the time, I was not interested in vlogging it. I just wanted to enjoy the moment with my friends. But when it came down to the last three outs, I was like, you know what? I got to film this. I got to film my reaction because this is a once-in-a-lifetime moment, a once-in-a-lifetime reaction. 32 years of spent up losing all came out in that moment. So here we go. Okay, right after this at bat, I'm going to take a pitch. Looks like we got a tie game here in Petco Park with the runners on first and second. Time for Benny No to be clutch, baby. Here we go. He does have a hitting streak on the line. I oh, he hit the home run, so the hitting streak's over. That's definitely going to bring in two runs, baby. Oh, he's safe. No, he was out, but I did make solid contact, and I did drive in a run. How did I not get that? That was two runs that scored, right? I mean, the second one was... None of them scored? Oh, I must have... How did the runner not score? Okay, whatever. Back to the World Series. Here we go. The end of the game is here. All right, I'm going to show you the epic video. This is my initial reaction to the Dodgers winning the World Series. Bobby was also there. He had his friend filming, so he got a very, really good angle. And that's actually where the picture and the thumbnail came from, was Bobby's camera filming all of us my face obviously the moment when it went you saw my face it was epic no more waste no waste no more time here we go here is my epic reaction to the dodgers winning the world series you guys one out away one out away one out away baby 32 years one out away come on let's do this there's one strike baby let's go come on 
Oh my god, it's happening! It's happening, you guys! I don't know, I'm, I'm high, man. Let's go, come on. Please. Please, one, one more out, baby. Come on, Julio, we're all rooting for you, baby. Two, one more strike, baby! Let's go! Yes! 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 Someone just threw beer on me. I don't care. Let's go. You're gonna see our reactions right here. Come on. Come on, baby. Yeah! I mean, I'm still on cloud nine. The Dodgers won the World Series. I mean, I have my Team Benny shirt on with my Dodgers World Series hat because both of us won World Championships this year. Oh my God, you guys. I can't even begin to tell you how euphoric that moment felt. I mean, for the last four days, I've been on this amazing this amazing high and just recently i started to get home and relax and man i didn't even this is how excited i am i had a pitch hit scenario i know i have a hitting streak on the line and i wasn't even thinking about it and we rip one into right field for a base hit so the hitting streak continues and there it is 54 game hitting streak for benny no epic series you guys i'm so proud of my dodger team i'm i'm, I'm tip my cap to the tampa bay rays they were phenomenal who knows if they don't take out playing Snell, what happens? But nonetheless, they took them out. The Dodgers are victorious. World Series champions 2020. I've been telling my friends every day, I'm going to be telling them we're the World Series champions for the next year. So I'm probably going to be saying that a lot. Let's jump into this next game. It has been so nice to run into all of my friends who are Dodger fans. Um, I even got calls. There's a base hit. 55 game hitting streak in tag, baby. I got calls from old friends, old co-workers I used to work with who remember how much of a fan I was. And hearing them call me just made it extra special. Especially when I got home and got to hug my wife and son. Unfortunately, Lumpy could not go to the World Series. With everything going on, it just didn't make sense to take my son. So... Uh, he didn't go, unfortunately. That's probably the one bummer thing about it was he, he was not there in person, but he's young. Hopefully there's many more Dodger opportunity chances. We'll be going soon, hopefully, back to the World Series, and he will get a chance to experience that. But when I got home, man, he was super excited, of course. And actually a main reason why, you know, now that I'm thinking about it, why I went on Instagram Live is because I told my wife, hey, go on Instagram Live so you could show our son my reaction so that was initially the whole reason why i went on instagram live was so that lumpy can watch and if you guys remembered i think my whole family you know my buddy t-mobile was crying and sobbing next to me i cried when i got home you know i mean it was just an epic day you guys it was just so amazing i mean wow and then to top it all off when i got home my family was nice enough to go out and buy all the world series gear for me I got the Los Angeles Times newspaper, had an article of them winning, three different World Series shirts, I got the World Series hat that you can't find anywhere right now, it actually doesn't even fit me, it's super big, it's a seven and three quarters, and I'm actually a seven and three eighths, but nonetheless, don't care, I'm wearing it, it's our year, I have to wear the gear baby, and then to top it all off, Team Benny wins the championship against Team Bobby, I mean for me, <laughs> for Team Benny fans, that is just the epic, the ultimate man, it's been an amazing baseball 2020 season as far as Major League Baseball and softball goes, man, alright, here we go, let's jump into this last at bat, I'm not sure of the score because I cannot see the Anaheim score, it looks like it's a four run game, it might be a tie game, the Anaheim might be winning, 
Here we go. We're in the eighth, baby, and that ball is lifted to center to Trout. And it doesn't even look like Trout's playing center in this World of the Show series. We get the base hit. Challenge com uh, completed. Are we going to get another at bat? No, we'll just take a quick replay at this so I can express to you guys for a few more seconds just how epic it is for the Dodgers to win. Oh, one more at bat for, not for Benny. No. Now, a lot of people have also been asking me about the Justin Turner scenario. I'll be honest, you guys. At the stadium, I had no clue what was going on. I had no clue until I went on Instagram Live and everyone started sending me messages. And I'll be honest, at first I thought it was a, a really bad joke, you know. And then I realized, wait a minute, nope, that wasn't a joke. That was real. That ball's launched to right. Come on! Oh, warning track power. But nonetheless, for me, it's special because my memory does not include any of the stuff that went on on TV that you guys saw. I didn't hear any of that. So my memory of the World Series is obviously gonna be one of euphoria because my team won and I was just super excited, you guys. Leave a comment, let me know. How was your World Series experience? Are you a Dodger fan? Are you not a Dodger fan? I gotta admit, there's a lot of haters out there. Hopefully you guys are cool non-Dodger fans, but if you're not, sorry, the Dodgers won. Every team had the equal chance. So for anyone to say this was a tainted season, <laughs> Sorry, you're just not a fan of baseball. We're out of here, baby. Peace.